We've done as you asked. Good. May the bloody vultures feast on his corpse and shit him into the ocean. <laughs> I'm telling you, I love this guy. Welcome to the Red Eye. Tell your uncle I'm making the arrangements now. Any luck? Yes. They've agreed to help us. I'll speak to Mirren and see when the bribes can be made. Wait here. I guess we did it. We're here to stay, at least for a while. No more running for our lives unless we really have to. If only Bethany were here with us. And Wesley. Let's just see what happens. We have a long year ahead of us. Thus began the champion's first year in Kirkwall. Word arrived from across the sea that the hero of Ferelden had defeated the Blight. But Lothering was destroyed. Kirkwall was the champion's home now. So she made her name, settling her debts with the mercenaries. It was a busy year in the city. That's when the Kunari landed. A great storm had caught their ship and left hundreds of warriors stranded in the city, waiting to return home. That's also when the trouble began with the mages. The Templars had become very powerful under Knight Commander Meredith. But most importantly, that's when I first met the champion. Stays tits, human. You know how many people want to hire onto this expedition? Look, we know you're going into the deep roads. You'll need to hire the best, and we're. No! You're too late. Already done. The money from this trip could fix everything. You need us. We fought Darkspawn. Look, precious. I don't care if you tore the horns off an ogre with your bare hands. You make him understand. We're running from your bloody Templars. My brother has a point. It's on his head, but it's still valid. Oh, thanks for that. So, what about it, Bartrand? We're just what you need. You're looking for a quick way out of the slums, right? You and every other Ferelden in this dump. Find another meal ticket. Well, back to waiting for someone to turn us in. It'll get harder if we're at each other's throats. I know. It just seems like you either die in this city or you end up like the scum we're bargaining with. We need coin, status, something we can shove in that dwarf's face and keep people off our backs. And all I can think of is Uncle Gamlin. He got us into the city, more or less. If there's a chance, he can push Bartrand. Worth checking, I guess. What else can we do? We're losing ground, 
and I don't fancy waking up in the gallows. of your pockets just by smiling at you. But you, you don't have the style to work high down, let alone the merchant's guild. You might want to find yourself a new line of work. <laughs> Off you go. How do you do? Merrick Tethrus, at your service. I apologize for Bartrand. He wouldn't know an opportunity if it hit him square in the jaw. But you would. I would. What my brother doesn't realize is that we need someone like you. He would never admit it either. He's too proud. I, however, am quite practical. You're part of Bartrand's venture. That's right. The Deep Roads wouldn't normally be my thing, but I can't allow the head of our family to go down there alone. So, as you might imagine, I have more than a passing interest in this expedition's success. What makes you so certain we can help? You know nothing about us. Oh, on the contrary. You've made quite the name for yourself over the last year. Serving with the Red Iron is no mean feat. Yet you not only served, you impressed. The name Hawk is on many lips these days. Not bad for a Ferelden fresh off the boat. You must have heard of my brother as well, then. A little, yes. But it is you they speak most of, Messer. That figures. Your brother is certainly welcome to join us by all means, but I'll leave that in your hands. Oh, I'm going. Without this expedition, we won't last out the year. There must be some way to persuade your brother to hire us on. We don't need another hireling. We need a partner. The truth is, Bartrand's been tearing his beard out trying to fund this on his own, but he can't do it. Invest in the expedition. Fifty sovereigns and he can't refuse. Not with me there to vouch for you. It sounds interesting. But if I had any gold, I wouldn't need this job. You need to think big. There's only a brief window after a blight when the Deep Roads won't be crawling with Darkspawn. The treasure you find down there could set you and your family up for life. Come on. The dwarf makes some sense. No offense. Look, you started this, and it's a good idea. Certainly better than ending up in the gallows. We work together, you and I, and before you know it, you'll have all the capital you need. What do you say? There might be nothing down there except Darkspawn and Rubble. How can you be sure we'll make a profit? Well, Bartrand isn't grasping its strings. He's operating on some good information. Some of the Deep Roads are so old, even the Dwarves have forgotten them. We just need to get down there, then Bartrand will lead the way. You and I will be there to handle problems. It's not like I had anything better planned. Perfect. Kirkwell's crawling with work. You set aside some coin from every job and you'll have the money in no time. Sure. Easy. But... Maybe aveline has got some bounties out. She joined the city guard, right? We should talk privately when you get the chance. In the Hanged Man, maybe. I'll be there when I'm not with you. Now. Let's go see what trouble we can stir up. You ah, high town, where the rich go to piss their money away. <laughs> this really is the best place in Kirkwall.
I don't want to see any trouble from you. Welcome, merchant. Not here to sell today, guardsmen. My shipment's late. Well, good luck to you then. Long time no see, my friend. Worthy. When did you get back into town? Oh, uh, just a month or so ago. Things didn't work out in Orzammar. You still with the Red Iron? It was just a year you were with them, right? I'm looking to become an explorer of a sort. I heard. Bartrand's hard to take. But his information is usually good. Hard to take? <laughs> That's putting it mildly. I'll tell you what. I still have my old contacts. You need some rune crafting done, I can arrange it for you. Take care, Hawk. Don't get dead. You know, Junior, it's eerie how resemblance there is between you two she's my sister of course there's a resemblance oh you thought I meant Hawk I was talking about Gamlin make her I hate you dwarf Hello, Hawk. Been a while, hasn't it? What? Oh, right. Sorry. It feels like we just talked. I've been keeping an eye on you. 
Information is one of the few perks of this job. Watch out for Bartrand. He's a son of a bitch. Still having trouble? I thought you were past all that. Lately, I don't know. I've been pushed out to some dead patrols. Maybe I stepped on someone's toes. You can be... forceful. My charm, right? I should be able to go where I'm needed. In fact, I might have a job for you. Let me know if you want to do a favor for Kirkwall. Otherwise, I'm here if you need me. Maker knows I could use more satisfying work. Seems like Kirkwall suits you. It has been a challenge. Lots of opportunity, if you're the type the locals want. Are you? If you argue enough, you kind of convince yourself. The blight is over. You could go back to Lothering. That wasn't home for me. It was just where the Horde pressed us. It wasn't the first village I saw fall. But you don't get used to people losing everything. I'd been away already. I don't know if I'd still call it home. Sometimes the best thing about a place is that it's where you're from. This must be a very different pace from serving King Kaelin. I love that life, but there's a new king for a new Ferelden. Seems cocksure, but I guess he was there when the Archdemon fell. Can't fault an active hand. It's just one more change, though. The real end for me was Ostagar. What about you, Carver? You were there. Do you feel something similar? No. All right, then. Bit of a tit, your brother. All right, Aveline. You have something worth doing? My patrols may be empty walks in the dark, but there's something big coming up, and I could use you. An ambush, probably for a caravan. Although I can't find any shipments that match up. Doesn't matter, though. High women waiting for someone to rob. I'm putting a stop to it, my district or not. Do you have a name or anything else to go on? Not important. If we show up and they attack, they're bad. Simple as that. I'll wager it's smugglers, though. Like I said, seems like an obvious trap for a caravan. You've been nosing around outside your commission. I have contacts. And they're complaining about a lack of meat. Thugs and such. Someone is hiring. And one or two were told to prepare for travelers. You want to be good at this job? You pay attention to what's missing and when people arrange escape routes. Aveline? You've got yourself a partner. I knew I could count on you. They're hidden up Sundermount, remote and rough, but we can make good time with a shortcut this side. And no, you can't run off and do it without me. I trust you, but I have to be there. You're acting on behalf of the Guard.
I don't think I can do that. Messer, please stop kicking the wall. Who are you to talk to me like that? 